Good evening, everybody. I'm Brett Thomas. And I'm Heather Heron. A Fort Wayne doctor is at the center of an investigation led by the DEA and the Attorney General's office. He is accused of overprescribing medication. News Channel 15's Holly Campbell begins our live team coverage from our newsroom. Holly, what do we know about the doctor? Well, according to the DEA, Dr. Michael Cozy prescribed more controlled substances than any other prescriber in the state from January 2014 to February 2016. Cozy is the owner and operator of Fort Wayne Interventional Pain Management. In that same time frame, the Attorney General's office says 90% of the prescriptions Cozy wrote were for controlled substances. Broken down, that's 2 million doses of oxycodone and 1.2 million doses of hydrocodone. Between January and February of this year, Cozy prescribed controlled substances to about 1,700 patients. He saw 90 to 100 patients a day during those two months. Investigators say Cozy overprescribed to people who clearly demonstrated serious risk behaviors. According to the DEA, three of his patients died because of drug use. One patient received 50 prescriptions from six providers in the last year. Cozy wrote 35 of those prescriptions. The Medical Licensing Board will hear the petition to suspend Cozy's license Thursday in Indianapolis. Cozy has been booked into the Allen County Jail on a preliminary narcotics charge. Live in the newsroom, Holly Campbell, News Channel 15. There were two homes raided today, one in southwest Allen County, the other in Huntington County. Take a look at this map here. The first home located in the 6,000 block of Post Road near West Hamilton Road on US 24. The second house is on North 500 East in Roanoke. Officials from several agencies descended on both neighborhoods. News Channel 15's Angelica Robinson continues our team coverage. She joins us live from Hamilton Estates neighborhood where one of those homes is located. Angelica? Well, several law enforcement agencies have been in and out of this house right behind me on Post Road. Now, all is clear now, but earlier today, the street was lined with dozens of law enforcement cars. Around 9 o'clock this morning, the DEA served a search warrant for the home in the 6500 block of Post Road. Several other agencies are assisting in the investigation, including the Fort Wayne Police, the IRS, and the Medicaid Fraud Unit. All total, about 30 cars lined the streets today. Now, we learned this afternoon that another house was being looked into about three miles away, which was also owned by Dr. Cozy. That home is located uh, north 500 east in Roanoke. Helicopters flew overhead with about 20 law enforcement cars on the ground. Dr. Cozy owns a third home right across the street from that one on Roanoke Road. A neighbor tells me that authorities also searched that home this morning. Now, this isn't Dr. Cozy's first run-in with the law. In 2014, he was arrested and charged with domestic battery after a woman said he beat and strangled her in their Fort Wayne home. Those charges were later dropped. Now, this is a developing story. We will continue to bring the latest information as it becomes available. Reporting live on Post Road, Angelica Robinson, News Channel 15.